My name is Stephen Cook and I'm a Canada Research Chair at Carleton University in Ottawa, Canada. I love all things fishy. Uh, our lab studies the ecology, behavior and physiology of freshwater and marine fish with the idea of generating science to inform sustainable management and conservation of our aquatic resources. Being a fish ecologist, I think there's a, a lot of people who assume that I spend day and night studying the fish and only the fish. And the reality is that we spend just as much time studying the people. I increasingly find myself going back to my, my roots, which are more in the environmental studies side of things, recognize that people are oftentimes the cause of the problems that we're dealing with with respect to fish, but also the solution to those problems. One of the things I'm particularly proud of is our ability to generate science to help inform restoration activities. But the reality is we haven't necessarily had the science to support the restoration that's being done. So we spend a lot of time helping to generate that evidence base. A lot of that work's involved telemetry. Uh, we've been doing work in Toronto Harbor and Hamilton Harbor in particular, trying to understand fish, fish habitat relationships, and use that to inform the ongoing restoration habitat enhancement activities in those areas. I'm certainly an avid angler, and that is probably the, the reason why I'm here today as a fisheries professional. I'm also fortunate in that I get to continue to fish. Much of the work that we do in our lab focuses on the recreational fisheries sector, so trying to understand how we can develop guidelines with respect to gear or angler behavior so that when people catch fish and those fish are to be released that they have the greatest likelihood of survival. So we work on species such as muscalunge and largemouth bass, smallmouth bass and so on, trying to generate science, understanding what factors contribute to mortality and what we can do to ensure that the fish that are released are likely to survive. Being an educator, I'm fortunate that I get to interact with learners of all ages. I spend time in classrooms with, with young children, obviously the university students, the undergrads, the grad students, the postdocs, and then the community members that I get to interact with routinely. It certainly keeps me fresh as a researcher and on my toes, but also an opportunity to share my passion for the environment, for fish, for fishing, and I certainly take any and all opportunities to do so.